Ahoy fellows, we're going to be playing pinball today. I did do a little bit of this already, but I didn't quite like the intro and also I died like immediately, so never mind. We're going to be playing pinball. We're going to start from here because screw you all. But yeah, there we go. Let's just act like I charged that door by like 10,000 or whatever. Also off camera, I got a spoon. I got a wooden spoon from the uh, from the town. And I upgraded my bot core to level 4, so we're doing very well for ourselves today. Let's just put it that way. And that's honestly putting it lightly. I have also been playing a bit of the game on my own time. So yeah, we are um, very well equipped mentally for... okay. Uh... I, I dashed away, and yet I still get hit. Very poggers. Uh, <laughs> hit right into it, too. Um, I know I mentioned the spoon, but we're not really going to use it, because the fan blade is just significantly better than, like, everything, really. Everything that I have right now, everything that I know of. Kind of. Um... Actually, hold on. Never mind. We're not going to worry about that right now. I was going to mention something that's kind of way later. For now, we're doing branching paths. I feel like I do this kind of thing a bit too much, maybe. But, um... Too bad. Oh, God. Please let me dash away. Uh, this is the, the death room. Clear death room. <laughs> Very bad. Oh well. But I've actually been playing this a lot um, off camera. I'm really enjoying it. And it is an, a, a wonderful breather from the way that I was doing recordings. I'm definitely having a lot more fun with the games that I play right now. Because I'm not just playing like Cave Story and Celeste. And even then, like, Cave Story is at a point right now where I, I don't know what the heck I'm going to do with it. Ow. Yeah, I'm going to reset, reset the room. I need three of them. Come on. I got to know where they're going to be. And... Oh, hey. This is extremely unfog. Here we go. And now. The cool thing about these is that they don't actually... They kind of like... They... Excuse me. <laughs> I just love when I have the charging bit out and I still get hit. Like, it's, it's automatic. So... I don't know how it happens. It's like how I was saying that I'd be I'd whiff the ball a lot. I don't know how it happens though. And it, it's like sometimes sometimes I like change around items and I stop whiffing so hard. Here we are, focus hammer. This is a good one. We get bullet time, sort of. It's it's helpful. For if I have to do things fast in terms of actually hitting the balls, not that I actually do things like that, because I lucky here. Why would I worry about it when I can just uh, not worry about it? And hell, I whiff anyways. What does it matter? <laughs> what am I doing? But hey, we get a nice, fun room full of things to beat the crap out of, and that's all that matters. Yeah. I'm trying to remember what I was using in my own playthrough. I think it was Focus Hammer and then something else that I think I got from the next place we're gonna go um, after Archives, so that'll probably be an entire other episode, and I don't want to get too meta, I guess, or overly spoilery or anything like that. I don't think I'd be really spoiling much, but 
The, the, um, the, the floors get bigger and the rooms get a bit harder. Like this one is about my favorite room ever. You'll tell. You can tell. I do like that the dash, you, I, oh god, no, yeah. Just get the heck out of there. ASAP. I do kind of like you can move around, but it's wacky the way that it handles it. I don't know. Oh yes, fun healing room. We're going back to the fun healing room where I can get fun heals and not die. Because I do enjoy not dying. Uh, this is nice. So, what are we doing today, really? I feel like I'm already halfway through the video, honestly. <laughs> In terms of substance. I think there's another branching path. Okay, no there's not. Why do you persist? Do you think I'm not watching? I know you're watching, that's why I do. You're forcing my hand. Which one of them? You are a lost scrap of rust who is out of their depth. I mean, you're the one in the depths, pal. Turn around or I'll stop you. Um, I did it, guy. I turned. I Yeah. I got a teleporter up and running, so we're going to be able to come back here after I die. There's like four floors here. One, one two, three, four. Yeah, four. Sheesh, four entire floors. And you're going to... And he's gonna throw orbs at me and stuff. Sucks. Honestly, like, they're not terrible, but it, it just sucks having to deal with them. Especially while I'm also dealing with the reddens. The reddy. Ow. Uh, just need to get myself a safe zone. Yeah, there we go. But yeah, he, he'll... It, the, the game gets to a point where, like, the areas flood with the, 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 uh, the balls that hurt me. And that's just really cool. But... I'm also very good at the game. Okay, so about me being good at the game. I lied. I lied. I'm sorry that I lied. I'm not actually good at the game. There we go. Very nice. Very nice. Nice and nice. So very nice. He's a chan. Oh boy. Okay, no, it's not something that was gonna hurt me. Cool. Oh wait, I should have done that in a different order. It's still happening, kind of, where I'll, I'll hold down the button and it doesn't... See, they're hurting themselves. What an idiot. One more floor. I haven't died yet, so that's nice. Um, here's what we'll do. What did that open? Oh, it's a timed one, too. Alright. It should be fine. If I can aim. It's the, it's, it's the, um, I'm gonna make an excuse, all right, and you're gonna take it. So, it's the angle of the floor, I think, is what messes me up here. Because I'm thinking about it as top-down, but it's just ever so slightly not top-down. It's at a slight angle. Slight enough that I keep approaching it as a top-down, and then I <laughs> fail utterly. Things like that. The creature withdraws. We did it, guys. We've freed the archives. Now I just need to uh, charge up balls and things like that. We're going to very quickly approach a point where I'm just kind of up to date with everything, I think. But hey, lore time, my fellas. Archive. <clears throat> Sorry. I think I found a way to create a new renewable power source that went with enough to use the. Uh, 
strong enough to use for the North Star. If I can harness it into a portable core, we can build a line of robotic engineers that can run the machine. The working title for the power source is currently the Bounded Orb Transfer Cores, the BOTC. Interesting. Anyways, Bounded Orb Transfer Cores. The things I'm smacking around. There's a photo with the captions. The kids in the town where they play stickball. They've been watching the Botsy engineers swinging around the tools Danielle made for them and turned it into a yard game. Nice. I do swing around tools a lot. That's fair. The market on Main Street was full of new seasonal stalls this weekend. Markets from merchants from beyond the sea came to town and bought exotic breath. Yeah. Yeah, that. Oh, God. I wasn't able to read the lore. Dozens of old data cartridges are covered in sand and rust. Con connections to the terminal are corroded, but some appear in working condition. Much of the research data stored here is gone forever. There's a single empty slot in a straight cartridge. Tartridge. 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 Anyways. Archived history file. The road leading out of town goes back into the desert. I think it connects to one of the maintenance entrances for the machine somewhere out in the dunes. Oh, is that where I came from? Wow. Yeah, Archives is really good for lore. I feel like we don't get quite the same level of... Oh, hey, there's interesting things going on from <laughs> anywhere else. But that doesn't matter. The anywhere else is where we're going next time. Alright? Lockdown systems. For now, like, comment, and subscribe, or I will lock down the systems that cause you to live. Ha ha ha. Very funny. Goodbye! Yeah, I hope that one. I thought it was pretty funny.